Good evening, everyone. Hey, Sarah. Guess what time Hi. it is? Um, hold on. Is it Booker O'Clock? We've got together. We've made the Booker Boy Book Club schedule. Welcome Hugo. to Team Booker, everybody. If you're watching this. You're automatically a part of Team Booker. Sorry if you didn't want to read these. You're gonna to have to now. There are thirteen books in total. Thirteen decadent books, and only one of them is going to win. Fifty thousand mm-hmm. pounds at the end. Well, of probably. The, the definitely only one. It might happen again, right? I don't want it to happen again. They couldn't. Well, they, me they, neither. So give us a little bit of leeway, just a case of you know, life gets in the way. We're gonna try and crab everything in twelve weeks. And Sarah and I have come up with a wonderful schedule for you. Perfect. All the dates will be down below. You can read so- it, and then you can watch our reviews on it. You can review review it yourself. Be a part of. Be a part of the review train. Connectivity. Let's get the obvious ones out of the way. And I think the one mm-hmm. that most people have read based on the current right. Discord is Second Place by Rachel Cusk. So on the 2nd of August, both Sarah and I and you should finish Second mm-hmm. Place by Rachel Cusk. On the 9th of August, Sarah, what are we doing? Oh, well, we're going to have two. <gasps> what? How do do you even have time for that? I know. Uh, <laughs> once again, banking on, you probably read at least one of these books already. So uh, no one is talking about this and Clara and the Sun. Hey, Sarah, do you hear that for next week? Oh, it's only the longest book. Oh, there. Look, yeah. We all got hype. We all we're, got energy. We're all here. We're on this you, train. We're on the train. You've got your orders in. We're going to smash mm-hmm. out. 600 page great circle i'm kind of pumped for i think it's going to be great i'm like oh i'm excited about it or i'm not excited about this one no thoughts except big so once once we're we've gotten our way through great circle we're gonna need a little breather and a moose bush we're going for the shortest book an island by karen jennings right did i get that right yeah that's i didn't write down the author's names so i'm going off memory it's kind of you did did a good job there. As I had one thought on Great Circle, which was big, I have one thought on an island. Small. 30th of August, we're going to read, like, the most thriller-esque from, like, what I can gauge by it. It sounds good, and I hope it's good, but it's A Town Called Solace by Mary Lawson. I'm going to leave A Town Called Solace. And where are we going? What direction? Sri Lanka. North. All right. oh. Yeah, that works too. Yeah. Like, cool. We're the passage North. A passage North is next. And then the day before the shortlist is announced, which is the 14th of September, on the 13th, we will, if we all follow this, we will have read over half mm-hmm. of the long list. Incredible. And what one have we stuck right in the center? Light Perpetual by Francis Spufford. Because it's either going to be really good. Or a bit meh. Yeah, that's that's my exact thoughts on it. Either either great or meh. And what are we going to read on the 20th of September? The Sweetness of Water. Sweetness of Water it is one of Oprah's book club picks. And it's also on Obama's summer reading list for this year. So I feel like it's going to be a very readable book. It's going to be a good book for right after the shortlist is announced. That's what, like riding that high. Just something yeah. we can just, just truck keep, along. Just keep going right through. Then and we're going to hit it. <laughs> I think it's the book that me and you are the most hyped about. 27th of September, the review of China Room by Sanjeev Sahota. I just want to oh, get man. through all, the, like read all these other books just so that I can read China Room. 100%. But then after that, we're going to... Still excited. Come to my neck of the woods. Coming to Wales, people. We're, we're heading to Wales, everybody. Honestly, I'm so <laughs> I'm so like pumped for this one. The Fortune Men by Nadifa Mohammed. I deliver on the corner from Tiger Bay, which is in mm-hmm. the docks yards of Cardiff. And I am ready for it. And hopefully I'm gonna do my review in Tiger Bay. But maybe I'll go to where the water is to talk about it. The Bay to Shining Bay. <laughs> Next up, <laughs> we'll we'll be doing the Promise on October 11th, which is by Kieran Damon Galgut. 
everyone's ready for it. Mm-hmm. But we just want to let that train depart. Just a little bit. We'll ca- we'll catch yeah. her up. We'll see mm-hmm. if the hype really lives up to a little bit of breathing room. We'll like let it go a little bit and then we'll grab onto the end, the last second. Ride it right into the last book. Go into space, people. We're go grabbing the, the train. People. It's going to leave the tracks right into space. Bewilderment. Richard Powers review on the 18th of October. Now you might say, why is this last? It's because the only one that's not out yet. We're both very excited about it. We're um, both big fans of the ogre story. Then we're going to punch it out. Third of November, the winner is announced. That's where everyone starts like backing for books and all the knives come out. And mm-hmm. I'm ready for a fight. If I could back War of the Poor, I'll back any old thing. <laughs> yeah. I'm ready for it. For Book of 2021, I feel I feel it's my time to shine. I feel it's all gonna be like, yes. Maybe so we had a year we had an award where we were both like it's like it's a good it's a good book, good book. the end <laughs> it's a good book i don't think That's it's anything it. hugely special it's holding up for its sugar <sighs> oh Shoggy Bean won. That's it's Shuggy Bean. What more what more what, what what what's there to say? Mm-hmm. We had an award where I was like, yeah, and you were like, Mugh. it's International Booker Day. <laughs> That's right, the winner is being announced. Well, okay, the winner's already been announced. I just have to work. <laughs> Let's find out what won. Okay, I'm nervous and I'm just gonna like Google and it'll be like the first thing that pops up. International Booker 2021. I just clicked on it, but I haven't looked. (gasps) (laughs) So this is what it feels like to have a book you wanted to win, win. (laughs) Oh my god, I'm literally gonna freak. Come on! It's the op. It's the op. It's the op. Oh, well, you know. You win them. You win some, you lose some. <laughs> I read 13 books. <laughs> Maybe this one will be my time to be and you to be yeah. I'm ready for it. Or maybe we're both like, yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I can handle it. It's fine. Come November 3rd, we're both going to be like, yeah. Yeah. If you join the Booker Boy Book Club Discord, the order from top to bottom is the order we will be reading. So you can always keep up to date. And Sarah and I will endeavor to publish reviews on said date. Links down below. Join the Booker Boy Book Club. It's going to be amazing. It is. Any final, a, any final words, Sarah? Any final words? <laughs> no. I will end it right now.